Hey, hey, I'm AG. Welcome to this week's blog. This week I want to announce our Zuba program. This is a very, very, very exciting program for us to get, to get into. What Zuba diving is, is essentially surface supplied scuba diving. So the idea is, is again, that the cylinder is floating on the surface. The heavy equipment is floating on the surface, providing the air down below to the divers below. And it's actually the cylinder is floating on a raft that's easy to tow around. So let me tell you a little bit about this program. What we're so excited about Zuber and what we're so excited about this program is that, as you well know, UTD is sort of a company that has been extending our UTD covenants and our DIR philosophy into various different areas, creating the mixed team diving and creating this idea of extending our covenants of consistency, scalability, and interchangeability into all these different areas. You well know we were, of course, back mount. Then we went into CCR rebreathers. Then we went into uh, 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 side mount diving. And now we, we, we went into scientific diving. And now we're going into surface supply. And the idea here is not to replace scuba diving. This is a bridge between snorkeling and extending down, like extended snorkeling and scuba diving. It's for those kids or adults or people that are interested in scuba diving but don't really not interested in having the weight on their back so it's a really really killer program we have a, a confined water program that's like for resort courses and confined water in which you are supervised in the pool and you go in the pool and you utilize just the regulator and you swim around and you enjoy you know um, the, 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 the fun of being underwater in a confined water environment and having 20 feet six meters of hose with a tank floating and you basically swimming around having a great time but you, you know the most experience you need is of course is just to be able to swim so you don't really need a lot of experience a lot of experience we have a training program for that so a little training program for the confined water and away you go and you know there you receive kind of a, a certificate of completion more than a an, an actual um, uh, 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 a certification system now when we're talking about the the the, the Zuber Junior program and the and, and the open water program there, what we want to do is we want to provide a, a way that the diver can actually be dressed in a full D system. So they will actually be wearing a full scuba system. So this program, Zuber Junior Open Water and Zuber Open Water program is designed that the person actually gets to wear a scuba system and has a power inflate. They can actually power inflate. They can oral inflate a point to compensator. They have a primary regulator, as you can see. They have a backup regulator. They have, if they need, a dry suit inflator hose. So again, the surface supply can be done in any environment in the world. I know right now we're in beautiful Hawaii, in Maui, but in other environments, you may have to wear a full 7 millimeter wetsuit. You may have to wear a dry suit. So with Zubra, this makes it possible. You can do that. So I'm going to go ahead and put this on and demonstrate how this works. Okay, so yeah, you see me dressed in a, in a Z system. And again, in the Z system, you see me have the primary regulator. It's donatable like all of the rest of the DIR configurations. Just like our side mount, our rebreather, and our, and, our, and our back mount open circuit. You can donate the primary regulator. The backup regulator, the safety second, is just on a, on a necklace and just an easy reach away. You can see once again that the system has the ability to power inflate and the, and the system has the ability to oral inflate. So you have a full buoyancy compensating device that has between 20 pounds of lift, which is about you know somewhere around 7-8 kilos in the Z-Trim, to almost 50 pounds of lift, which is about 25, 22 kilos of lift in the Z Plus. So you have a variety of buoyancy compensators depending if you're diving cold water, heavy weights, and so forth. So the Zuber diver would be wearing a proper full system. And again, if they had a dry suit there, they would have a dry suit inflator so they could plug in their dry suit and away they go. So they could even have a full dry suit system. Now, how do we power this? Once again, the Zuba, the heavy equipment, the tanks, are actually floating on the surface. And I love the Z float. This is called the Z float. And it's great because it accommodates the tanks, it straps the tanks in, 
you can zip everything up. It's a, a floating raft. What's beautiful about this raft is you can let all the air out and you can take it with you when you travel. So it's, it, it, it's inflatable from the tank itself. Off the raft you have the normal first stage like you would any other first stage on scuba. But it powers the hoses and you can have one hose for open water or you can have two hoses for open water. You know, in other words, you want to have two people or you can have individual rafts, one per person. The hose, of course, is coiled up when not in use, but in use it's uncoiled and it gives you 25 feet of hose, giving you the max depth of about 20 feet or 6 meters, so it's really great. You go ahead and you plug the hose into the system. So as you can see, you simply plug the hose into the system and then you tether the hose to yourself so the, the hose becomes tethered on the hip tether like that. Now you basically have full functionality. You have primary hose, you have backup necklace, you have power inflator, as you can see, the wing power inflates. So you actually get buoyancy. And this is really, really important because again, the skills that you'll be learning are all the skills from scuba, but you're not going deep enough to be either into decompression or to get lost because you tethered to the raft. So this is a great program, a great solution for UTD to provide junior open water certification. The junior program is from 10 years old to 16 years old. And what's really great about this is all the problems that you see a 10 year old getting certified to dive are eliminated. Let's look at them. The 10 year old is worried about the weight on their back. I mean a scuba tank and all that is a lot of weight. Again, this floats everything on the surface, so that's eliminated. The junior diver can get lost and you know just swim off in some direction and dad can't keep up and doesn't know where his son is. Again, now dad and junior are tethered to the to the raft. So junior can't go anywhere. He's tethered to the raft. He's, he's right there. He can no longer go deeper than 20 feet. That's really important, both from a, a psychological point for the for the child, but also from a decompression point. We don't really know the long-term effects of decompression illness on children. So we know that 20 feet in shallow is, is, is a benign depth. So the scuba is really a great way to get your son, your children involved in scuba diving activity without the risk. You know, the biggest risk in scuba diving is the lung overexpansion injury, and we have a full training program. They will do two hours of classroom, an online classroom. They'll do two hours of pool, and then they'll do two open water dives. They'll demonstrate lung overexpansion injury drills such as swimming for ascent while exhaling and things like that. So the program actually certifies them to go out and do this without the supervision of an instructor, but in direct supervision of their parent or guardian. So we have all this stuff on our website. Of course, the, the full open water program is for 16 years and older. And that's again for people who don't necessarily want to scuba dive, who don't necessarily want all the weight of scuba diving, but want to go out and enjoy this sport but better than snorkeling. You know, snorkeling, the water goes down the tube, you can't stay underwater, blah, blah, blah. This enables you to extend snorkel, so to speak, and have fun up to 20 feet of, of, of depth maximum. Again, you go through a full proper training program. The training program includes two hours of classroom, two hours of pool, and open water dives, and you get certified. And that allows you to both purchase the equipment to use and take and travel with you, as well as to rent the equipment. You can go to dive stores with your certification card and you can rent tanks, you can buy air, you can get your tanks refilled and actually go out and participate in the sport. So it's a really, really great program for sort of the in-between the two. And yet, to be consistent, scalable and compatible with your, your buddy. Because look at this, this is a Z system. So for instance, if I decided that I wanted to go scuba diving, I would simply unconnect the Z system from the Zuba, I would take the tank and I would attach I would attach my side mount system, my travel side mount system and my regulator with the drive hose and I could side mount the cylinder and now I could go scuba diving. So the way this works is really awesome because I can Zuba with my wife in the morning and then in the afternoon I can go for a proper scuba dive in the same equipment dressed exactly the same. And the best part is, if she ever decides to become a diver, or your, your significant other, he too, ever decides he wants to become a diver, all the skill, all of the equipment, all of the training, all of the philosophy is consistent and scalable up into recreational scuba diving, technical scuba diving, 
overhead scuba diving and so on and so on. So we're really, really excited to bring the surface supplied, the surface supplied system into our family, into our mixed team diving philosophy. So now you can side mount, you can rebreather dive, you can back mount, you can even surface supplied dive. And so we have a lot of exciting ways in which we're tackling the water sports and bringing the UTD DIR philosophy to all of our um, different areas of scuba diving. We've set up a couple of websites. The first one is scubadiving.com. That website is a website centered around the social aspect of it, understanding the programs, it's an informational website so that you can learn about zuba diving and what it is to be, you know, zuba diver uh, dry suit class and zuba diver dive master and instructor and so forth. We have all of those structures and programs as you need. We also have zubaequipment.com, which is the equipment website where you can purchase the equipment, you can purchase the regulators and the, and the Z float and the Z trim device and the and the buoyancy and the reg and every, all, everything you need to go and participate in zuba diving as 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 with you and your significant other. Anyways, if you have any questions, please feel free to email us at info at zubadiving.com. We look forward to your questions. We'll answer tons of questions and so forth. And most important, go to the zubadiving.com website and look up the instructors and all the facilities we have on a worldwide basis. And as usual, guys, or as always, safe diving.